Mommy, are you hungry? Oh my god! Oh my god! What happened? Look! Oh no! Ta-da! What? A, a hundred thousand dollars in debt? What happened? I borrowed it! You borrowed? I said I borrowed money! Why? Ugh, I lost in gambling and borrowed money to the black market and... Before I knew it, I was $100,000 in debt. Ugh, I messed up. And it's black market money? What are you going to do? Mm, I'm sure I'll find a way. In the meantime, this. Huh? What's that? It's a divorce registration paper. What do you mean? Let's get divorced and you'll become a single mother. If you receive welfare, I can return the money little by little. Well, I'm such a genius! <laughs> what are you thinking? Because that's the only way. I quit my full-time job and I'm only working part-time. I'm fine with you working full-time while I take care of mommy. But are you fine with that? B but I know, right? You can't leave it to me. It's also fine to receive welfare and still be married, but if that's the case, we'll have to sell this house. So I thought that maybe it would be better to get a divorce and you become a single mother. I really don't get what you're saying. Hey, hey, I'm saying this for you and mommy. If not, those scary debt collectors will come after you too. Don't you think it's better to find a way to pay the debt before that happens? But we don't have to. We'll be in huge trouble if we don't do so. If we don't do anything, we won't even be able to afford mommy's milk. Anyway, go apply. Uh, but... That's the only way left! My name is Misaki. I live with my husband Kenta, who is addicted to gambling. A year ago, he wasn't like this at all. He was very kind and used to putting his family first. But when Mommy was born, he won with beginner's luck and got addicted to gambling since then. <sighs> what should I do? Do I really need to get divorced and receive welfare? Are there other options aside from... Hey! Huh? W what is it? You're uh, Kenta's wife, right? You know my husband? Yes, I'm the one who lent him money. Could it be the black market money? Right. Oh, I'm so scared. So, he's the one who lent the money. He's probably come to collect the money. I... I'm sorry. Huh? I don't have money, but I'll earn some right now. Make some right now? What do you mean? I will get divorced, become a single mother, and apply for welfare. So, with that money... Did you think of that by yourself? Huh? I'm asking you if you thought of that yourself! Ah! No, my husband did. I see. Just as I thought. What a bastard! I'm sorry. Hey! <sighs> what is it? Tell me your current situation. I wonder why. Will he get angry if I tell him and we can afford nice things? I'm scared, so I guess it would be best to tell the truth. Then, after listening to my story, he went home with a menacing look on his face. <sighs> I should go home now, too but I'm not sure whether it's really fine to receive this paper bag. But I already received it, so... I'm home! Hey, Musaki! Did you apply for welfare? How was it? Uh... Um... Aha! So you did! Thanks! Our issue is settled down for now! Oh, right! This is a black money account. You need to make full payment. With the total amount, you receive from the welfare every month. <sighs> With this, the weight has been off my shoulders now. I think I'll go gambling now. What? You're going again? Wait! No problem. <laughs> I'm a gambling prodigy. So I'll go earn money. You always say that and always end up coming home with nothing. You can't pay off your debt if you keep on doing that. Stop gambling and work instead. It's fine. The welfare money will all go to the payment of debt. 
We're at least able to pay $1,000 per month, right? With that, we can pay off our debt within 10 years. With that said, I'm off now. I said wait! Ugh. Will the past Kenta ever come back? My dream was for the three of us to live happily, but will that dream ever come true? Then, one day... Hey, this is for the month. Mr. Inazuka, thank you very much. I don't deserve your gratitude. Who will be grateful by receiving money from the black market? But... How's your husband lately? <sighs> He's still the same. He doesn't go to work and gambles all the time. I've told him many times to work, but... Oh, I see. So, he hasn't changed at all. But you still can't take the step? Deep inside, I still expect him to change. Is that so? I understand that feeling. Really? So you have trouble with your wife or something too? No, not wife, but he's a subordinate who can't be helped. His name is Heiji. Your subordinate? He's always been nothing but helpless. But I somehow always get my hopes up, even though he always disappoints me. Ah, uh, I see. Sorry for talking nonsense. Uh, no. <laughs> that is so good. Huh? Heiji, why are you here? And why are you crying? I don't understand. You thought of me that way? I'm so moved. I will follow you for the rest of my life. Uh, putting that aside, what's with that bucket? Ah, uh, well, it's nothing. I never thought of splashing water because you're flirting with a woman. Uh... Heiji! I will bury you under the ice of the North Pole! Dad! Help me! I don't want the North Pole! Please at least do it within the country! Hey, wait, Heiji! Don't escape! Ha <laughs> ha! The one who escapes wins! You? Dad! I guess Mr. Inazuka is also having a hard time. I guess Kenta won't change like that Heiji guy. Hey, Masaki! Huh? What? Stop fooling around! Huh? What are you so angry about? Of course I'm angry! You lied that you are receiving welfare! What are you saying all of a sudden? When I told my gambler friend about our technique, he told me that you must have a different house if you revenge welfare. He also said that it is strange that you're always at home. I haven't seen you go to a different house too. You do not receive welfare, do you? You're right. I did not receive welfare. So you were rejected by the city hall. Then why didn't you tell me? But the debt collector didn't come, so that means you're paying it with secret savings or something, right? Hey, show me your savings. So you were able to pay off $100,000? You still have secret savings left, don't you? I don't have anything like that. Liar! I'm sure there is. Hey! Quietly hand it to me. I will double it. Hand it to me, come on! Hand the money to me, the god of gambling! You only won once! You don't have to care about the specifics, just hand me the money! If you don't hand it to me, I will divorce you! You can't receive welfare! If we get divorced, you'll be homeless! You have nothing to say back. No, we already got divorced a year ago. What are you saying? Huh? You've got to be kidding. There's no way. I mean, really? Really? You're the one who told me to submit the divorce paper, so I did. Because at that time, I thought that I can receive welfare. W what? But someone stopped me from doing that. Yes. Mr. Inazuka. That day, he listened to my story. You shouldn't receive welfare. But if I don't do anything... You're another one who borrowed the money. I will collect from your husband. The one who borrowed the money. You don't have to worry. I mean, you shouldn't use welfare for that reason. Those who need it most won't be able to use it. <sighs> You're right. I'm very sorry. I understand you were driven into a corner. Do you know how to use a computer? Y 
Yes. Okay, I'll hide you. What? At the black market? No, we have another company. I will introduce you to a company where you can do remote work. You have a child. It's better that way, right? Uh, but why would you do that? I heard from your husband that he has a wife and a daughter. You know how your husband is, right? So I got worried about whether you and your daughter are living well. That's why I came here to meet you. <sighs> is that so? Why would you do that much? I didn't want to lend him the money. But my subordinate made a mistake. But please! Are you gambling? Please lend me money! No! And Azuka told me! That we don't lend to those who use it for gambling! I mean, I'm just house-sitting! I'm not allowed to lend money! So? I won't use it for gambling? So that Inazuka guy won't get angry if it's not for gambling, right? Right! Then I guess it's okay to lend you money! Here you go! <laughs> I'll take responsibility for that. My subordinates are really useless. That paper bag contains alimony. Please take it. I'll say it again. Don't hand it to your husband. Use it for your daughter. What? I can't take that. Just take it. As for your salary, do you prefer through bank transfer or I personally bring it to you? Huh? If your account is being held, then I think I should personally hand it to you. Um, so, please do the latter. Understood. Also, I will strictly collect money from him. Is that okay? Get out of that house. Yes, um, please wait. Huh? Um, could you please extend it? Extend? My husband used to be kind. He might go back to become his past self. One year. Please wait a year. I will make him work and tell him to pay off his debt. Understood. Well then, I will contact you again. Thank you very much. That's what happened. The money I received from Inazuka at the park was not debt, but my salary. Well, I asked for a year of extension, but... Kenta didn't listen to me and never changed. What's that? Anyway, that's how it is. We are strangers. And I can financially support her daughter. Actually, today is a year since Mr. Inazuka and I promised. What? I'm sorry. It's beyond my power. For not being able to bring you back to the kind you that I know. So, Mommy and I will get out of this house. Thank you for everything. Goodbye. Hey, wait! What? Based on what you said, the debt collectors will be severe, right? I can't endure that! Please, don't go! I will! I will change! I will definitely change! I wanted to hear that earlier. I can't wait anymore! But I love you! Mommy too! So please, please think about it again! I... I loved you too. So bye. Masaki, don't abandon me! She really left me. That insensitive person! Masaki, you came back. Thank you, I will change. Uh, you are. We won't abandon you. We will take care of you until you pay off your debt. Uh, well, um... $200,000, pay it properly. What? Did I borrow $200,000? Interest is $20,000 and $80,000 to your ex-wife for child-rearing support. Th there's no way I could pay that much! No, I will make you pay! You deceived me! Inazuka scolded me because of that! I cried a lot! I will make you pay no matter what! No, I didn't do all of you! I've donated the money I borrowed to the born children in other countries! Really? Oh, you're a good person after all! I judged you incorrectly! Oh. What are you doing, Azuka? Of course he's lying! He used it all to gamble! 
You really easily believe. Hey! You deceived me again! I will never forgive you! No, it's true! What? It's a lie! Hm, you did it again! Oh, Kanta, shut up! I'll really do it. Hey, G, add $100,000 to his debt. What? Add $100,000 to me, debt? What are you saying? The additional $100,000 is for the donation to poor children. Now your lie has become the truth. Take responsibility and donate $100,000. Yes, I will do my best. Off I go. Uh, wait. Now, what should I do with you? It seems like he's unemployed, so maybe we should introduce work to him. Hey, G, do you know of any good jobs? Um, for this season, there is room for recruits of the Bering Sea. Bering Sea? Does that mean fishing for crabs? I can't do that! There are also other jobs, like internal organs. Right, I guess that's another option. I'll go! Oh, I love crabs! Ah, I'm so happy that I can fish crabs! <laughs> Is that so? You really love crab that much? Well then, I'll send you off for ten years. What? Ten years? Um, okay, so the insurance will be for ten years, right? Yeah, that's fine. Wait! Please wait! I don't really like crabs! How disrespectful to the crabs! Yes! Try to imagine being in the crab situation! Hey, G, don't you think he needs to know more about crabs? I guess it's better to send him until he knows what it's like to be a crab. You're right, Itazuka, absolutely! But, but! Okay, I'm sending you off for 10 years to understand how crabs feel. Bye! You're kidding me, right? I don't want that! Wait! Please wait! I don't know what happened to Kenta after that, but Inazuka sends me crabs, so I think Kenta is still alive? How are you? Are you happy? Yes, I'm happy thanks to you. I'm glad to hear that. Mr. Inazuka, thank you very much. I told you not to thank black market money. Mr. Inazuka, it's not normal black market money, right? I heard that you're helping single mothers and fathers financially. The company I work at was also made to support people like that, right? Well, I guess I agree. It's not normal black market money. I'm a gang member after all. Huh? Uh, I might have just heard it wrong. Call me anytime you need help. I will lend you a hand. Or money. Y yes Now I'll take Heiji in one shot. Did Heiji do something again? That moron. He used my car to transport a lot of crabs. Because of that, my car smells like crab and I can't take it! <sighs> Heiji... He really doesn't learn no matter how many times he does not. Maybe I should send him crab fishing too! Bye! Yes, see you again! I feel like Heiji, who Inazuka expects from, will be a big shot in the future. I somehow think that way. I'm amazed at how he can prank him like that. I guess it's not a big deal at that point. I went through a lot, but thanks to Mr. Inazuka, I can live my life the way I want to. I'm very grateful to him. I will live happily with mommy from now on. All right. I will do my best as a mother!